That's hey, Max, I want to ask you about that Rockets team, man, like, yeah. and, and the championships that you were blessed yeah. enough to win. Um, what do you say to those? Or let me pose it a different way. Were you guys aware, like, MJ not in the league, that yeah. a window may be open? Or were y'all like, no, MJ or no MJ, dog, this is, this is our time? Well, we was MJ or no MJ. It was our time. But shit, uh, in the back of our minds, I knew we was like, damn, okay, Mike ain't playing shit. And, you know, it was going to be an astro mark by the damn you know, 93, 94, 94, 95, you know, championship team. So because of MJ was playing, you know, trying to play baseball. Uh, so, right. but um, uh, we, we, we knew it was going to be motherfuckers saying that, but you know, but shit, uh, like I keep saying, once again, motherfuckers, the numbers don't lie. I mean, when we were playing them, we were beating their ass. I mean, we were just a problem for them. We matched up well against them. I mean, just like Seattle matched up well against us. We couldn't beat them motherfuckers. Gary Payton, Sean Kim, uh, uh, all the motherfuckers they had out there. We couldn't beat them up. Ricky Pierce, all the motherfuckers coming off the bench. They just had a bunch of, you know, they had a bunch of motherfuckers that, that matched up well with us. Nate McMillan and I mean, they just had a Dana Barrows. They had a bunch of motherfuckers. Dana Barrows. Yeah, I'm trying yeah. to see motherfuckers forget all about yeah. that little shooting motherfuckers shooting from the parking lot. <laughs> the motherfucker was dangerous, man. Um, couldn't guard <laughs> nobody, but that motherfucker showed up stuff. <laughs> God damn. But I mean, so, yeah. I mean, we just couldn't get past them, man, and shit. Uh, but uh, but just look at the numbers, man. I mean, we'd have, we'd have beat their ass. Fuck that. <laughs> what is it? What is it like? What was it like playing against MJ, man? What was it like? Because you were somebody that was a foil for him. You were somebody that that got under yeah. his skin. You didn't give a well, fuck about Roger, MJ. Yeah, Roger, like? Roger, no. You know when you play against that motherfucker, you got to be a little different. You can't you can't go in that motherfucker game like passive and 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 like that motherfucker. He he can he can sense a motherfucker if you're scared. He's a killer out there, man, and he's a dirty motherfucker. But I'm just saying, <laughs> yeah, he was. I mean, you have to be, man, to be that great, man. I mean, yeah, night in, sure. night out. You you have to be a dog and have to have that grit, that that dirty shit and all that. So, I mean, Roger know what I'm talking about. Listen, I, Max, so I got MJ at the tail, but I got his little bro. Like, I got Kobe yeah. in his prime. Okay, that's and right. He was... He was the just same right, dude, the same though. Like, killer, that's right. And and Logan, the craziest thing is like there are a lot of dudes who, who who are are really good players, right? Like great skill sets and athleticism combinations, all of that. But the truly great ones, like, and it's only a few of them. That's right. They smell. They smell the fucking fear. Yeah. They test you early. Yeah. They test you early, yeah. and if you don't put, if you don't stand up but, to that yeah, shit, yeah. it's a wrap. It's a wrap for that night. It's, yeah, it's, it's well documented. It's well documented the first time, or one of the first times, Roger got tested by Cole. But what was one of the first times that Mike tried to test you and well, tried to test Joe Gangster? What well, happened? I, think I, I, I tested. I put that shit out there. You know, I think mm -hmm. I was trying him. You know, I think he was just like, I don't think he really knew a lot about me. But, you know what I mean? But I know he knew who I was. But, um, but I was fucking with him. You know, trying him. I what was you doing? Him. I just, you know, talking shit, like saying little shit, get a bucket on him. Yeah, motherfucker, it's going to be a long night for you, too. You know, <laughs> goddamn. And, um, but, you know, I just saying little shit and just, just want to, couldn't believe I was out there playing against this motherfucker. And, you know, I just want to see if everything I heard, it, it was true. And shit, it, it was everything, it was true. What, what is that sure. a lord? You know that a lord that you see when you play, like when you know. For my generation, it's like when LeBron come to town, right? When LeBron comes to town, there's an aura around the whole building, and I'm sure, and that affects right. players too. That's what um, I'm even trying when to tell you. even when Steph even when Steph right. comes to town, like there's an aura, right. like oh shit, he's right. coming to town. Right. How do you block that out? How do you block? Say fuck that, fuck him. I, I'm me yeah. too. I'm Vernon Maxwell. What? How do you block that out? And how fast did you have to do that before you play, Mike? Well, it's it's crazy because you know it's it's, it's a different damn um, it's a different thickness in the air when you walk in the gym with Michael Jordan in the, in the, in the arena. Mm -hmm. You know, you can it's a different vibe all the whole day. You know, it's people everything. perked up a little oh, bit more. Everybody, everybody perked. <laughs> you know, yeah. every motherfucking body perking. I'm on the edge and shit. <laughs> I'm sitting back over this motherfucker looking at these motherfuckers with this red and black on. I don't know if they for the Rockers or the Jordan. So I'm over this motherfucker. I'm eating lunch out here. I'm mad as shit. I'm 
looking at these motherfuckers, they waving at me, bitch. I don't know how they, I don't know if y'all from joining me. So, you know, yeah, I'm already getting myself ready. But yeah, it, it, it's it's a different vibe. Well, when I tell you when 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 motherfuckers like them come in your city. So you just gotta, I just didn't, I didn't think about it as much. And, you know, I just I I I'll go and get a lot of rest that day. You know, normally I won't, you know. You weren't hitting the streets rest. before then, huh? Was you hitting the streets before you played Mike? No, nah, I never could do that. <laughs> nah, there's certain yeah. motherfuckers you can't hit the streets with. You know, like Reggie Miller and Mike and, oh. you know, and um, motherfuckers, you got to chase around. Pedro Sto- uh, man, uh, uh, what's the boy's name? God Pedro bless the dead. Uh, no, nah, not the boy, uh, the boy from the boy from Yeah, Drossin, Drossin God, y'all, yeah. shit, yeah, God bless the dead, good God. Yeah, that motherfucker right there, and you have to go and sit down and get off your feet for them motherfuckers. Hey, you got to be ready to chase a motherfucker all night long. Mm-hmm. 